Aries? Really? Really? I I would not have guessed that you were an Aries. Hi guys, and welcome back to a new video. Yes, we're here with the very first episode of the new series, looking at friendship within astrology. So in today's video, we're going to be discussing the 10 reasons for why you need an Aries as a friend. All right, so firstly, if you would like more insight into how to interpret it, friendships within your own needle birth chart, then check out my introduction video, okay? Also, feel free to let us know why you think Aries makes a great friend in the comment section. All right, so let's get right into this and just spread this platonic love. First reason for why you need Aries and Aries as a friend it's because I think it goes without saying, but Aries people, Aries people will tell it to you straight. They are not the types of people who like to talk around a situation or a scenario, you know? So here's the situation, the scenario, and not about going like this, they just, they just get straight to the point, right? To the point, they're very direct. They're gonna be a type of friend who really tells you what you, you need to hear, not what you want to hear. And they're gonna tell you to your face as well. See, for an Aries, they want to know where they stand with you and where you stand with them. Aries not knowing will just agitate them. It's about them getting the truth out of you and vice versa. I think that it's this upfront honesty is the best policy approach that's very is a very important quality when it comes to friendship because it does suggest that they aren't the types of people who will lie to their friends either. Of course they will still understand if you're perhaps upset and if they do sense that you are upset. This is when the Aries will bring out their caring and their affectionate side. I remember speaking about this with an Aries lady in my work a couple of months back and we were discussing astrology and she said that she's more like the little lamb and lambs, if you think about lambs, they're so adorable. They're so adorable and they're so fluffy and cute. So remember, as tough and hard as Aries people can be, where they just want to tell you straight, they just, they, it's like, They'll tell you what you do need to hear rather than what you want to hear, so it's all very honest. At the same time, underneath that, there is this little lamb. There's a little lamb who wants care and love and to provide care and love towards their loved ones. So that's the type of friend you're gonna be dealing with here. And that's great. And this leads me on to the second reason for why you need an Aries friend. And that is that they are going to protect you with everything that they have. They will defend you as a friend and fight your corner if you ever need it. They're not afraid to stand up against those who are trying to drag you down. <laughs> me and my sister, we both have Aries moons. And I remember my sister was forever getting into fights due to her defending my brothers and the rest of us. And even myself, I also got into a fight with another girl whenever I was younger because I was defending my friend who was being picked on by this girl. Now whilst I know that violence is not the answer, it's not the answer, but I do think that for Aries people, as they grow, they learn how to handle their impulsive lash out tendencies a lot better. I certainly have, I certainly have. Though, still, that doesn't mean that my blood doesn't boil whenever I see unjust injustice happening around me. Oh, I'm usually the first person to stand up and say, hey, that is not cool, stop doing that. So yeah, having an Aries friend in your life will mean them to ending you if you ever need it. But also keep in mind guys that it's about fighting for the greater good. So if the Aries does feel like you are maybe in the wrong in the situation, that you are the one who's not being very fair, then they probably will not have a problem with uh, expressing this to you either. If anything, I think this is what makes them an extra good friend for doing this. <laughs> the third reason is that this is gonna be a friend who understands the meaning of independence. Aries people know how to remain independent from the influences of their friends. And this is really due to how Aries people are leaders. They are usually the types of people who want to lead a group as well. But at the same time, whilst they do pioneer the group's efforts, 
they also understand that independence of each person is very important. So for example, if someone wants to maybe leave or whatever, they will just happily watch them leave without trying to force them to stay. They're not going to be like, no, 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 you need to stay here. They're just like, right, okay, I understand you're your own individual, you're your own person, then go off and do that. But I'm still in the pack right now. I'm still here. As long as you don't try to force me to move, that's fine. Because trust me, do not try to force them. That's when you will be met with much resistance. <laughs> they just get that a friend, no matter how close he or she may be, they cannot be there for every minute of the day, okay? This would simply just lead to an unhealthy, dependent friendship. So whilst an Aries friend will be there for you, they will be there for you, they also want to see you stand on your own two feet. And so whilst they will teach you lessons that you need to know, it's you then who must live out your own life. All right, this leads me on to the fourth reason for why you need an Aries friend. And this is really because of their ability to use their hardships and their struggles as things that make them stronger. They're able to use their life struggles as strength to motivate themselves and to also motivate and inspire others as well. This is actually why so many Aries people make such great motivational speakers. I have noticed a pattern actually with the amount of uh, motivational speakers who have an Aries moon, so the likes of Steve Jobs, Tony Robbins, Gary Vee. These men are highly encouraging men and they do possess this really get up from the grind attitude. What? What are you doing down there? What are you doing? Get up. Get up. Now whilst they do get that, you know, we all go through things in life. Not one of us doesn't. But what is important is that they use these things as almost ways to fuel their fire. Aries people are fighters, okay? They are about fighting for a cause. They want movement, okay? An Aries person who feels stuck in the mud is gonna be a very upset Aries. And so guys, if you do have an Aries friend, know that they will want to lift you up when you feel like you're being knocked down. But at the same time, they're also not afraid to give you a little slice of some humble pie if your ego needs it. It's all about growth for the Aries and personal development. So by having an Aries friend, know that they will play a role in really helping you with your own personal development. The fifth reason is because, well, they're, they're gonna be a super fun friend right? They're going to be the friend who is very energetic and lively. You're just going to be sitting there with your Aries friend and suddenly they'll just say, hey, do you just want to go and do this? What do you think? Yeah, yeah, let's just, let's just go and do this. And you know, that's just it because there is this compelling urge, a compelling urge, this huge burst of energy within them where they just want to do something fun and exciting. Say it could be a spontaneous trip to go shopping with them or maybe they suddenly want to go and play a game of tennis or maybe they want to go dancing. Maybe even it could be that they want to go motorcycle riding and you're looking at them like, mm, I don't know about that. Um, well, <sighs> okay. Whatever the case guys, okay you can expect a very spontaneous friend who just who just wants to enjoy life wants to enjoy life and make the most out of it on that note though also be prepared for the passion that they drive into everything they do okay you might be slightly taken aback actually by their passion yet they seem to make all of that intense enthusiasm just seem so easy Definitely, if you have an Aries friend, be prepared to buy some protective gear. Be prepared, because you just do not know. You're just, you just don't know where you're going to end up when you're hanging out with them. They will have you spirited away in the most unpredictable of places. They will just pull you out of your bubble and into a whole new world of these new experiences. The sixth reason for why you need an Aries friend it's really due to their forgiving nature. Let's face it guys, we all mess up from time to time. 
We all make mistakes. Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody has those days. Everybody knows that what I'm talking about. Everybody gets that way. Yeah. So forgiveness um, is really important during these times. If you do ever mess up, it could be something as little as you just slipping out that that uh, they have a crush on someone that they didn't want that person to know. The Aries will forgive. They won't be the types of people just to hold grudges, you know, due to their direct behavior, right? They're just like, fine, okay, I'm gonna go up to you and I'm just gonna ask you about this and we're gonna iron it out and then we're gonna move on swiftly. Again, Aries is about movement. So dwelling on what he said or what she said, because let's face it, that is so annoying. Rather than doing that, they get right to the root of the situation. They take it out, they feel it out, they express what needs to be said. And if apologies are required on their part, they will do so. They will do so with nobility. A great friend is really able to forgive and is able to apologize. And these two things are what Aries is very much capable of doing. This leads me on to the seventh reason for why you need an Aries friend, and that is that they are extremely trustworthy people. In fact, they take pride in knowing that other people can trust them. Therefore, if you do have an Aries friend in your life, know that you can show your vulnerabilities around them and they will not turn their back on you for doing so. The eighth reason is because of how supportive they are. If this has not been obvious enough throughout this video, really, if you have an Aries friend, right, in your life, they will support your dreams, support your wishes, your hopes for the future. They will support any projects or ideas that you come up with, but more than anything, more than anything, they will push you towards making these projects and ideas a reality for yourself. They will genuinely, genuinely want to see you achieving your goals, okay? They're, they're gonna be like this cheerleader, this mascot just cheering you on with their pom-poms. And they're not afraid to give you compliments either. They're not afraid to compliment you either. To, to, you know, to tell you, hey, I really admire how you're so good at that. Hey, that new dress looks amazing on you. Though still, though still, <laughs> they're also not gonna be shy from saying if they think you could do something differently. Or perhaps if a certain dress uh, doesn't look the best in their eyes. <laughs> either way you wanna look at it, either way you wanna look at it, an Aries friend will do it because they genuinely care about you they do genuinely want to see you succeed. The ninth reason is that this is going to be a friend who likes to remain positive and optimistic, not just within the friendship, but actually within life. Aries usually like to look on the brighter side of life, even when things do seem slightly difficult or tough. Though still, if things don't go by according to plan uh, for them, that's when they might actually tend to blame themselves a little bit. So on that note, it's quite important to help your Aries friend if you do ever see them blaming themselves for situations that actually just were out of their control. But at the same time, an Aries friend will actually give you the same pep talk. They'll be like, hey, hey, I know what happened, but you do understand that it wasn't in your control, right? That's the type of friend you're gonna be having in your life. So guys, for them, they do want to do everything in their power to really make you feel good. They want to enhance your life and add to your life so they will be able to find ways to put a big smile on your face. You're just gonna leave after hanging out with your Aries friend feeling super, super energized. And lastly guys, the 10th and final reason for why you need an Aries friend is because they are very generous in their relationships. Generous with their time, generous with their care, generous with their words, even generous with their money. 
I mean, they will be willing to help you out of a bad situation financially if you do ever need it. But ultimately, guys, they are generous with their energy overall. Truly, all of these things are what makes Aries friends super loyal friends. The type of friends who remain firm and faithful within a friendship or relationship in general. You need their help, they will be there for you. You simply want to share an exciting <laughs> experience or exciting news with them, they will be there for you. You want uh, some straightforward advice, they're gonna be there for you. After all, these rams are the daring pioneers. All right, they're the ones who are willing to step into battle if it means truly being there for somebody else. Overall, guys, if you do have an Aries friend in your life, count yourself very lucky indeed because they are great companions to have and they would be like the musketeer that you never had. I myself just want to say thank you to all of the Aries people that I have in my life, you know, whether that be friends with an Aries rising, Aries moon, Aries sun, a lot of Aries within their chart. Just showing my love to Aries in general. Thank you, Aries. <laughs> okay, guys, so that concludes my video on the 10 reasons for why you need an Aries friend. Thank you all so much for watching, thank you for subscribing and as well if you would like to see more videos from me and you've not yet subscribed then go right ahead and click that subscribe button and I will be back with Taurus very very soon. Bye!